trouble, you felt emotion, and so how long is your special son? The police are ready to be in the unity of the Holy Spirit. God forever and ever. Mm -hmm. A reading from the book of Sirach. I thank the Lord and I praise him. I bless the name of the Lord. When I was young and innocent, I sought wisdom openly in prayer. I prayed for her before the temple, and I will seek her until the end. And she flourished as a grape soon ripe. My heart delighted in her. My feet kept to the level path. Because from earliest youth, I was familiar with her. In the short time I paid heed, I met with great instruction. Since in this way I have profited, I will give my teacher grateful praise. I became resolutely devoted to her. The good I persistently strove for. My soul was tormented in seeking her. My hand opened her gate, and I came to know her secrets. I directed my soul to her, and in cleanness I attained to her. The word of the Lord. The responsorial psalm is, The precepts of the Lord give joy to the heart. The law of the Lord is perfect, refreshing the soul. The decree of the Lord is trustworthy, giving wisdom to the simple. The precepts of the Lord give joy to the heart. The precepts of the Lord are right. Rejoicing the heart. The command of the Lord is clear, enlightening the eye. The precepts of the Lord give joy to the heart. The fear of the Lord is pure, enduring forever. The ordinances of the Lord are true, all of them just. The precepts of the Lord give joy to the heart. They are more precious than gold. Than a heap of purest gold, sweeter also than syrup or honey from the comb. Neither shall I tell you 
by what authority I do these things, the gospel of the Lord. Our scripture readings today invite us to reflect on authority, Jesus' ministry, put him up against the traditional religious leaders who led by power and not by authority. The basis of a true authority is divine wisdom, which is reflected upon in today's first reading from the book of Sarah. Today, in a special way, we have to remember that our pursuit of divine wisdom leads us to God. Gather together as one, let us return to God with our needs today. For our Holy Church, may God's wisdom continue to guide her. Let us pray to the Lord. For all of those who hold the elected office, may God lead them in knowledge and understanding. Let us pray to the Lord. For our faith and community, as we grow in wisdom together, may the Holy Spirit guide our ministries and programs. Let us pray to the Lord. Let's pray for special attention for Brittany Joseph. Let us pray to the Lord. For all who have um, entered eternal life, especially Vincenzo Baratta, may God lead them to everlasting joy. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord Almighty Father, you, your Son showed us uh, your way of authority through his work, works and words of love. Hear our prayers today and answer them according to your holy will, to Christ our Lord. Amen. Blessed are you, God of creation, for the goodness we have to the bread we offer you, because the earth and the Lord in the hands, and we can grab the bread of life. Upon them like the two so that they may become for us, the bodies and 
In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more giving a thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take your days, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be put out to for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me.
Shabbat. 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 Thank you. 